Well, this trailer has been in this driveway for a little over a month now. The landlord here has made countless calls with nobody to come pick it up. And with a concern for his tenants that live here, he's left with no idea what to do next. The guy who plows the driveway called me right before the storm. He said, hey, the trailer you have in your driveway is going to block the plowing. I said, what trailer? Jeffrey Christensen left with more questions than answers. What is it doing here? Where is it? Why is it here? What do I do about it? After he says someone dropped a trailer off in the driveway of his rental property. My tenants are, you know, concerned. Footprints in the snow coming from the door of the trailer, adding to the concern that someone is living there. Christensen says he called police who came to check it out, but didn't find anyone inside. And said nobody's in it, but it's on private property, so it's your problem. You have to figure out a way to get rid of it. Countless calls to towing companies and scrap yards brought Christensen down dead ends. Everybody says that's way too big, it's way too old, we can't do anything or we won't. There was one that said, oh yeah, we'll, we'll take care of it, and then never showed up. So until he gets a green light from someone willing to tow the trailer, the camper conundrum will continue. If anybody wants a trailer, <laughs> there's one here. Now Christensen says he's going to keep trying tow truck companies to see if anyone will take this thing out of here, even if it means calling out of state, and he hopes he finds solutions sooner rather than later. In Manchester, Marissa Tansino, WMUR News 9.